Muchas gracias a todos. Thank you, everybody. We have Columbus Crew head coach Wilfried Nancy for his post-match press conference. We'll start with questions in the room. Brianna McKay. Hi, coach. I first want to start by asking, um, you were down two goals at halftime. Um, you don't make any substitutions until Pachuca's third goal. I just want to ask, well, with the decision making in waiting so long to make those substitutions and was there any consideration about making substitutions earlier in the match? Um, we did a substitution, but without making substitution. So we changed the shape. We changed, uh, we tried to adjust certain things before, uh, doing a substitution. So the idea was to see uh, something different, to have another shape. And, um, yeah, that's it. Preguntas? Hi, Coach Emilio Lara from Fox Deportes. Hi. Do you speak this result or is a surprise? Uh, what do you mean? Le, um, 3 0 et 3 0. So, uh, but uh, I rewatch a bit um, the opportunity that we had. We had also many opportunities to score a goal. So, uh, we, uh, we were not uh, uh, clean, I would say, uh, when we attacked the box. We had possibility to, uh, when, when we started the game, we had a few opportunities that we could have done better. Uh, after that, they did well what they used to do, you know, uh, in terms of um, uh, the goal that we conceded could have been uh, avoided, I would say, because it was through the middle, knowing that we had a, we had a super American super humility uh, in this position. So um, I think that we, the goal that we conceded, uh, we could have done better, yes, uh, we know that. But uh, we had also many opportunities that we, uh, that we didn't uh, do. Um, bravo, uh, Papa Chuka. They deserve the win. So I will not talk about, uh, uh, if they deserve to win or not. They won. So well done for them. Le, my player gave everything, knowing that they were sick also. So we had, uh, all the team had a diarrhea. So since yesterday. So the staff also. So again, don't get me wrong. This is, this is a fact. I didn't talk about I'm not here to, to tell that uh, they don't deserve to win. We score, they score three goals. Okay. But uh, my player gave everything knowing that uh, it was not easy for them. Uh, Pablo Neria for Spot Soccer. What's the next step for, for Umbus after this match, after the final? The next step is, uh, well, the next step is, um, a few days, uh, because, um, as you can understand, uh, as you know, you know, to, when we lose the final, this is difficult because we are close to achieve something, but we didn't do it. So they're going to have to rest their brain a bit. And uh, like I told them, or we win or we, we learn. So I think that we're going to learn a lot about uh, this game, knowing that I'm really proud of my players. I'm really proud about what they did. I'm really proud since the beginning of the, of the, of the competition about what they did. We missed uh, the last step, I would say, but uh, we tried to do also what we uh, wanted to do, but it was not enough for tonight. Es profesor, buenas noches, Orlando Castellano, Servicio Informativo en Deportes. Hoy si ¿sí siente que esta derrota pasó en los primeros minutos donde cayó el primer gol y si su equipo se cayó en esa parte y ya en lo futbolístico no se pudieron levantar en lo anímico para poder salir adelante, para sacar un buen resultado de aquí de Pachuca y, y llevarse la copa. I would say, um... The first three minutes or five minutes, I don't remember, we had a few opportunities to score, but we were not good in terms of decision making. After that, uh, they scored the goal. Um, usually when we concede a goal, we know that we have time to come back. So it didn't change the mindset, the mindset. So I didn't feel that my team, uh, uh, wanted to stop or to quit. No, uh, they kept going, but uh, it was not enough. But the second goal, again, I think that uh, we wanted to score one goal during the first half to go back, you know, with the second half uh, with uh, only one goal behind. But we didn't, we didn't do it. But um, 
the two goals, you know, I am a bit, uh, it could have been better. You know, it could have been better the way we considered the two goals. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, they, they, uh, we knew before the game that um, um, up front they were good, you know, so in terms of timing with the run and also uh, uh, the possibility to keep the ball, you know, back to goal and after that to play the layoff. So we knew also that uh, they were able to attack also directly and they did it well also. Uh, and this is they play their game, you know, in terms of uh, try to play with uh, intensity. Um, they did also well uh, try to uh, switch the point of the attack. And uh, at a certain moment, we were a little bit late with that. Uh, but I think that uh, they had opportunities. They scored a goal within the play. But the other opportunity that they had, it was more about set pieces in terms of second wave or something like that. But uh, uh, well done by Pachuca in terms of... Um, was clear what they wanted to do. They tried to press us. We had possibility to come out of the press. We had a, we had a good moment, but we we didn't finish the action well. That's why he could have done a different game. Por acá Omar Flores de ESPN Digital eh, mencionó que tuvieron algunos problemas. ¿Qué problemas enfrentó el equipo desde ayer para este partido? Yeah, the, um, in terms of, um, I'm coming back with the goal, with the first goal and the second goal, you know, so, uh, so the first goal, it was through the middle. Uh, and again, it was a mistake of positioning, not only with my uh, back line, but also with my, uh, not only with the center back, but also with my back line and the second goal also. Uh, I think that, um, you know, the, they play quick back to goal. And uh, we didn't come back quickly. That's why they had the opportunity to, to keep the time that they had. And on this one, we we have to do better, you know, in terms of uh, uh, to come back a little bit quicker. And uh, on this one, I'm, I'm not happy with this one, but uh, they did it well. Thank you, everybody. We have time for one more question. We'll go to Charles Baum on Zoom. All right, thank you, buddy. That'll do it for today. Appreciate everybody's time. Look, bye.